Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Today I have got a Sainsbury's food haul for you. Um, we did the click and collect and we also nipped in the store and picked up a couple of bits. I think all together we spent about £155, um, which is a lot. That is for two weeks groceries and we've bought like non-food things. So I'll show you that as we go along. Um, I had two substitutions from the click and collect guy. One I kept, one I sent back. The one I sent back is we'd ordered a pack of 21 small dental sticks. Um, Darwin and Gilly aren't exactly small dogs in size, but they have small mouths, so we buy the small ones. Um, and yeah, it should have been like £1.10. And the ones they substituted for, um, it was like double the price for half the amount of dental sticks practically. So we decided not to get those and we'll pick some up in the week. Um, but yeah, that was the only problem and I will show you what we have bought. Okay, so quick overview. I'm going to have to do this in two parts because there's loads still on the floor. Um, but let's start on this end. We've got some wrapping paper. I think this is super cute. It's got pandas and bears and foxes and lions. Sorry if you can hear the squeaking. That is Darwin playing with a toy. Um, so yes also got some Sweet Freedom Choc Shot. I've been wanting to try this for ages. Half the people on Instagram I follow use this, so wanted to give it a go. Got myself a chunk of ginger. Some pine nuts for our recipe that I'm going to do this week. And then John got this giant tub, I think it's a kilo, of um, crunchy peanut butter. And then John picked up some coffee. This is the Kenko. I can't say that word. Whole bean instant. We've got four cupcakes. They're in the box, trust me. It's four cupcakes. Two pints of red milk. We've got some, oh, I'm gonna trash the face. We've got some breaded ham. Um, I've really wanted to try these for a while. Butternut squash lasagna sheets. I keep on seeing these on Instagram. Every time I've tried to order them online, they've not had them. So I was in store looking for courgettes and I saw them. So I had to try them. Hopefully they will be yummy. Um, I got a four pack of sugar-free polos. These were a pound. The other day I bought a single like tube of polos. It cost me 65p. So yeah, I was quite happy to get four for a pound. I got two red peppers. Some basic mozzarella pearls. And then under the wrapping paper there's some cherry tomatoes. Climbing over the bags on the floor. Um, some mushrooms, sorry about the shadows guys. Some mushrooms, I've got two packs of halloumi, a whole cucumber, uh, a bag of courgettes, which again, they had none of these on the website, but they did have them in store. Um, some ripe at home avocado, some corn style pepperoni, some prosciutto, some pizza bases. These aren't the ones we normally get. I normally get the genius ones, but they didn't have any. So I ordered these. These are cheaper, they're bigger. I think I prefer the other ones, but it's not a bad substitute. I've got one pack of the thin Warburton bagels, the plain ones. We've got some of the low fat hot crust buns, because I love them. Um, I got two ciabatta rolls for lunch today. Got some um, some cereal. Cereal's not a thing we regularly have. Occasionally buy Cheerios when they're on offer, but I kind of I like apple. I like cinnamon. Cinnamon. <laughs> uh, so I wanted to give it a try. It kind of seems like something I would like. Let's see how we get on. Um, I got some falafels because I like these very very much. John's not that keen. He'll eat them, but like I will quite happily snack on these and. Not one of John's favourite things. Frozen, I've got some, a big bag of broccoli. Got some Yorkshire puddings. It's all a bit lazy because they're quite easy to make. But yeah, <laughs> got some of those. Um, some frozen peas. Got some pea and asparagus risotto. Some pollock. Oh, we tried these last time for the first time. These are so, so yummy. It's quinoa, sweet potato, and sweet, I can't speak. Quinoa, sweet potato, and lentil burgers. They are so good. Even John likes them. So, yeah, if you have a Sainsbury's, I'd definitely kind of try these. 
Then we've got two corn, um, garlic and mushroom, whatever that word is. Linda McCartney um, red onion sausages. These are my favourite Linda McCartney sausages. And then we've got Linda McCartney um, steak style pies. And then also these aren't frozen. I'm not in order at all this week. And we've got some 12 mini chicken sartais. Cocktail sausages. Darwin and Gilly have these in their breakfast every day. I uh, picked myself up a... It's not really a sports bra. It's kind of like a crop top thing. Sports bra-esque. It's basically to sleep in. I need a bit of support. <laughs> so that's what that is. Um, then I've got this guy. Uh, yeah. It's a tractor pulling a trailer with some, like, a giraffe, a pink horse, and a green-blue lion. That looks lovely and fun, doesn't it? Um, and then some building blocks, 100 wooden blocks. That looks like a fun toy. And then over here, sorry, all the bags are in the way. Oh, oh, get my leg caught. So yes, so then sanitary products, so regular, super fun, um, some custard and John's deodorant and John's shower gel. Things behind it is old shopping, these didn't come. I picked these up in a veggie deli in the week, organic chestnuts. I'm going to roast those this weekend, but they, they didn't come from Sainsbury's and there's eggs, but they didn't come from this week. So that is the first half of this week's shop. Now for part two. Still two bags on the floor. Um, right, so loads of bananas. We always get bananas. I eat bananas like this and we always John has them in his breakfast smoothies. I also like to make banana bread, so that's why we have so many. Um, this was my oh this was my substitution. I ordered a, a leek and cabbage mix. I got spring greens. It works the same. It's fine. Um, I got a bag of popcorn. Pop Works Company in Sweet and Salty. This is really good. Also, the apple pie flavour is good, but we already have two bags of apple pie that we haven't ate, so I only got the one bag. These are somewhat of a guilty pleasure. I've got two packets of those. Got some brown sugar. I use this for baking. I got myself um, some unsalted, so or no added salt, low fat rice cakes. Got some basic sultanas. Again, I use this um, in porridge, in breakfast, and baking. I got a lazy person sponge mix because sometimes you need cake but can't be bothered. This works. I got three limes. I haven't had these in ages. Um, I got two packs of pink and whites. Uh, two cartons of apple juice. I thought I only got one, but I have two, and they're two different types. That one is apple and pear, and that one is just apple. I don't really know where this came from because I'm quite sure I only ordered that, but you know, it'll get used. Porridge oats, self explanatory. <laughs> two bags of spinach. Uh, a small pack of sprouts because you know we really like sprouts. I know some people only have them at Christmas, but we really like them. So sprouts, low-fat wraps, uh, a low-fat crumble dessert. These are really yummy. Some Outpro yogurt in blueberry and cherry, and then an Outpro yogurt in vanilla. Then um, some dip. This is sour cream and chive the low fat version, the low fat hummus, we always buy the multi-pack because it lasts longer, an aubergine, 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 one of them. Um, I got two packs of the pre-prepared mash, some red seedless grapes, a small unsmoked gammon, six apples, a pack of potatoes, um, some British beef, thin cut sirloin steaks, duck legs, skinless boneless chicken thighs, and two chicken kievs, red onions, parsnips, sweet potatoes.
And for the third and final section of the food hall, oh, Darwin's playing with a hot dog, that's what that noise is. So yeah, the final part of the food hall, um, I got some microwavable rice, so I got basmati, uh, this one is egg fried rice, and this one is mushroom rice, that one's my favourite. Um, I got some cannellini or cannelloni pasta shells, they're the long thick tubes, some basic sweet corn, curly whirlies, some green olives, I got six option white hot chocolates for, um, I'm going to attempt to make these unicorn hot chocolate type things, yeah, it's going to be in a vlog, so that's what that's for, uh, some low fat or the lighter sweet and sour cooking sauce, and the lighter tikka masala cooking sauce, some barbecue sauce, some pips and nut, um, nut butter, or peanut butter, no palm oil and all of that, uh, three bottles of caffeine free diet pepsi, some sardines for Darwin and Gilly, some gold stars to go on top of my unicorn hot chocolate, some food colouring, and some Italian passata with onion and garlic. And that is our groceries for the next two weeks. Um, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have, please give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, share, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye guys.